Meet Samira, the Desert Rose. As a young Shuriman, she made a name for herself among the war bands of Noxus by taking on the most dangerous missions with ease. She's a gunslinging, sword swinging marksman, with style above all else. Name Samira. Try not to slow me down. Think you can keep up? Welcome to the Samira Champion Spotlight. Samira's passive is her daredevil impulse. Wielding both guns and a sword, Samira can strike from a distance or melee range, switching weapons automatically when she attacks. Whenever Samira hits an enemy champion, she starts building her style rank from E up to S. Each hit must be distinct from the previous one to add to the combo, so no spamming. Weave auto attacks and abilities to stack your style. The more stylish you are, the faster you move. Increase its rank up to S to activate your ultimate, with more on that later. If Samira leaves combat, her style resets shortly afterward. I never go out of style. Additionally, if Samira targets an enemy affected by hard crowd control in her attack range, she will knock them up into the air, unleashing a flurry of shots at the same time. Juggling ain't just for clowns. Samira's Q is Flare, and she's got plenty to spare. She fires out a shot, and the first enemy gets got. If that enemy is in melee range, Samira instead slashes with her sword. No Rose is without its thorns. This attack can critically strike for a good chunk of bonus damage. Samira's W, Blade Whirl, has a passive that grants bonus damage to attacks with her blade. When activated, Samira unleashes her inner Swordmaster and spins in a circle for a brief moment, damaging enemies and destroying enemy missiles in the area. Move over, Yasuo. The Tilt Queen is here. With her E, Wild Rush, Samira dashes through an ally or enemy within range, slashing enemies along her path. Anytime Samira gets a takedown, Wild Rush's cooldown resets, allowing her to get back into, or out of, the fight. Messy, but effective. Activate Flare alongside Wild Rush to deal extra damage to targets along your path. Or use Blade Whirl right before you dash to save a teammate. You can put it on their tab. Keep the change. You're gonna need it. Remember that style rank you built up? Once Samira earns an S grade, she can cast her ultimate, Devil, I mean Inferno, trigger. Samira unleashes a sandstorm of attacks, hitting enemies in an area around her several times over a few seconds. These shots can critically strike and activate lifesteal, but not on hit effects. Hard crowd control will knock Samira out of her ultimate, so look for the right moment to go bang, bang, bang. Taking a quick break. Since Samira is always spoiling for a fight, this spell has no cooldown. As soon as you have enough style, she's ready to go again. And I'm not even looking. Samira is at her best when she's weaving in and out of fights, unloading at the perfect time. During the laning phase, she styles on enemies who depend on skill shots and forces them to fight on her terms. Pair her with an engaged support for some flashy plays in the bot lane. Team fights are where Samira really gets lit. Build style by weaving autos in between each ability as you go. Inferno Trigger can interrupt Blade Whirl, so when you see your moment, press W for a quick final stack and clean up with Inferno Trigger. With such a short range and only one escape tool, choosing the right fights with Samira is the difference between living fast and dying young. Came all this way to die, hmm? Be careful about being too wild with Wild Rush. Going in at the wrong time or on the wrong target can turn Samira into Sad Mira. Settle down, sweet cake. Ready to show off your play style in the bot lane? Play Samira, the Desert Rose. Check out the links in the description below to learn more about this flashy marksman. Now, who's ready for some pizza? 